This brings us to a close. Let's reflect on the material we covered. In Section 1, we defined soft skills and competencies and looked at ways you can promote these to engineering recruiters. In Section 2, we considered the importance of the PNG designation and what you can do to prepare for employment while you're trying to acquire it. In Section 3 and 4, we talked about the different organizational structures, what experience looks like in each of them, and how to customize your resume accordingly in order to help increase your chances of success as you're applying for jobs. In the fifth and final section, we revisited parts of each of the previous sections and addressed proper job interview etiquette. On behalf of ASPI, I'd like to thank you for watching this video module. Feel free to re-watch this module anytime on our website. Visit our website to sign up to ASPI's workshops and events such as kickstarting your job search, improving your LinkedIn profile, and other PD and employment related opportunities. If you're looking for support with the various stages of licensure, take a look at our courses for technical examinations, the professional practice exam, PPE, and understanding how to articulate your work experience for completing the PEO experience record. ASPI also currently offers a bridging program for international engineering graduates who are preparing to write the professional practice exam, or PPE, for the PNG license. This program provides international engineering graduates with a foundational background on the legal and ethical practices in the Ontario workplace, which are the two components of the PPE. To find out more about OSPI programs, services and membership, go to www.ospi.on.ca. We hope you found this module informative and that you'll be able to take our advice and find success in the engineering sector in Ontario. As engineers, we know the value of the work we do. We help drive the economy and make Ontario a better place to live, work and do business. And because of you, we're able to share that message with the rest of the province. So thank you. Let's continue to be the loud and passionate voice of engineering excellence that we've become together.